What's up everybody, it's your boy Sonny coming at you from the next episode of Sonny and the Show. Episode 33 makes me feel kind of fortunate. Uh, some people see the number 3 as being lucky, so I must be twice as blessed as what you would think. But here it is, 8 o'clock or uh, something or other evening, and I am, uh, if you can hear my nose stopped up, that's always pleasant. Everybody wants to hear some rambling weirdo with a clogged up nose. I don't know. Uh, what's, it, what's it going on, guys? I'll tell you what. I sat down and had this genius idea this morning. Got my little stick blender out and uh, threw in some pretty pebbles. Threw in a little bit of uh, vanilla bean ice cream and uh, a little bit of milk. And guess what I had? I had a few, a few, more than a few of the pebbles ice cream and some was they pretty pebble ice cream but I just said uh, pebble ice and it didn't sound nasty it sounds quite but what do you do so uh, I tell you what I'm going to be excited uh, we're not I'm not gonna have another day off until uh, Halloween or ish or so or something which I'm really looking forward to because uh, I'm just gonna sit at the house and chill. And I say that, and I'm probably gonna, you know, do something stupid. Uh, get up, you know, do whatever. Uh, I'm just in kind of one of those little halfway in between places. Uh, I've, I've said over and over and over, over and over again about the money deal, and some people just aren't getting it. And I know, I know it seems weirdly vague kind of a statement to make but I wish some people would just get on the train you know what don't put a foot on and then put a foot off don't uh, meander around the freaking uh, you know subway platform whatever just get get on just do the thing just get your whole self on and uh, don't screw around and that's especially one thing that you don't screw around with is money. Um, you want to screw around with whatever else? It's fine. Uh, we'll find a way to deal with that. But, in the words of Big Worm, you are playing with my money. And it's just like playing with my emotions. Uh, or did he say it in reverse? I don't, I don't know if I got that backwards. I'm just having that kind of day, and I swear it's it's weird. But uh, I am obviously looking forward to a day off. It's not going to happen until Octoberish, uh, and I'm starting to lose faith, uh, starting to be disheartened by the uh, management around this honky tonk. Because everybody has a certain kind of bliss, you know. Nobody knows what's going on. So, everybody's just running around acting stupid. Well, I got my coffee in my hand, you know, blah, 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 blah. I like coffee too, but, you know, first, before you get to drink coffee, let's figure out we have a plan. We have some kind of idea about what we're up to. It's silly. I have no idea. I just, you know, these people just baffle me on a regular basis. Just baffled. Uh, here's, some, here's some crunching for you. I don't know, guys. I'll tell you what, though. I am, uh, what was that? I have no idea where you go. I lost you. Boo, come back. Uh, I just want to sit and play uh, piano all day long. The sun comes up and I play piano. The sun goes down and I play piano. In between, I take a break, maybe to eat, maybe to go to the bathroom, maybe to get in the pool. Maybe. Get in the pool. The pool is negligible. Not exactly what I was looking for, but I'll tell you what, the pool is that uh, iffy. Whether or not I actually do that. But uh, here I am chilling with my fluffy beard on the outskirts of uh, nowhere. <laughs> nowhere. Nowhere. Wow, people, you see me in, you don't. Um, but it's it's interesting to me uh, what you what you can actually think of and what can, what you can actually pull off. Um, it's really kind of neat. Um, 
I run basically uh, the uh, basically what what's been referred to as the information desk. My talk show is uh, you know the bulletin forum for all things uh, Galaxy model, and uh, that's okay. I mean that's fine. But every once in a while I'm asked to go and do this thing or that thing, and uh, you know I'm I'm fine with that. Uh, I'm I'm really okay. I'm, I'm fine with that. But you know it was it was odd. I don't know. I can, yeah, I think maybe I felt bad the other day about uh, people nicknaming me uh, Jared, and I I started. Uh, I've known a couple people who've been through the years. None of them were worth a damn, but uh, it's okay. And I started asking people, why Why would you nickname me Jared? And I just had one girl look at me and she said, five, five dollar foot long. And I just kind of, I wanted to break down in tears. You know, I'm 80 years old and I don't need that. Jared's not even a good guy. Um, and they're not really naming me after Jared himself. They're naming me after the, you know, Subway's famous concoction. <laughs> so, let's come up with something better, people. You know, I, you know, I don't mind if you just call me by my, just my name. You don't have to call me darling, darling. But just do whatever. And here I go off on a rant. But it's not the thing. It's, you know... There's people, I get requests all the time for people who want to see me do this or see me do that. Call the studio. Call Galaxy and just say, hey, we want Sunday to get up in the thing. Uh, we want Sunday to do the thing. We want you to green light this thing or that thing. And it's, you know, that would be great. There's so many things. Um, <laughs> there's so many. I don't remember a lot of the girls that I've come into contact with, a lot of the girls that I worked with. Um, you know, but... I, I remember uh, some of them, some of them, the guys. That sounds horrible, but uh, you know, from a strictly puritanical fundamentalist sense, that sounds awful. But I remember all the guys that I've worked with, um, and uh, the, some of the guys would walk up to me and be like, "Hey, Sonny, what's going on?" I'd say, "Hey, let's do what? You know, let's hang out. Let's go do this. Let's go do part two of this." Let's go do part three of that. Come on, let's get it. Let's go, let's go, man. And you know, I don't exactly have carte blanche, but I do have carbla. <laughs> so, uh, that's, uh, that's gonna wrap it up for me today. And I'm really, really looking forward to hanging out with y'all tomorrow afternoon. But the sun's going down on a beautiful Nevada day. And, uh, Ooh, I've just been blah, blah. I felt like icky all day, you know. I felt like it's just like uh, there's something that you just uh, don't like to do. So, the first thing you need to think about doing is be cool. Not John Travolta and Cedric the Entertainer cool. I mean, like, that, that, that is pretty cool. Don't get me wrong. But I'm saying be cool. When there's time not to be cool, you need to be not cool to get up and being cool means I want to do what I have to do. So, be a hive yourself. Uh, stop looking at my weirdly fluffy beard and uh, get get outside, go do something. Take up the last few minutes of, of daytime and just do it. Go to bed early tonight, get some rest. You know, get caught up. Uh, you know, kiss your kids, kiss your wife, kiss your girlfriend, kiss, uh, kiss them all. You know, if you're if you're doing if you're into that kind of thing, uh, you know, try to talk your wife and your girlfriend to get in in the same uh, on the same page. It's not gonna work. Anyway, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm kind of off on a rant right now. I'm in I'm somewhere in outer space, uh, <laughs> playing Vegas. Um, so I guess uh, the only thing I can possibly do is is just tell y'all plain and simple. You know, I'll tell you again, I love you. And me, 12 minutes after, uh, it's it's great. So uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna 
run. I'm gonna take up running, screaming, I'll tear up all my clothes, I'm just gonna be a crazy madman, do whatever I have to do, and I'm just gonna tell you, I'm out. <laughs>